why you folks decided to open source it. I've thought about this actually recently a lot, uh, just thinking about the whole saga. It, I, I think it's straightforward. It's, uh, the story is like this, and I, I promise to keep it short. A few years ago, uh, I, had, I was given a task, which was split up this big, important uh, program application at Akamai. And uh, splitting it up uh, without slowing it down meant among other things that you can't be copying important data all the time because it would make it unacceptably slow. And at Akamai, every millisecond of latency is scrutinized and you just can't do it. I had to prove before anything that I'm not going to slow it down by splitting it up. So that's, uh, so I needed uh, some kind of IPC uh, and the things that were available out of the box were either too slow or too difficult. So. It started out in the beginning as simply something for this specific task. But then we were designing it uh, from the very beginning and it just felt like a general problem. It felt like something that was going to apply to a lot of people. Uh, so it's really as simple as that. Very early on, we were thinking about it and we decided to make it general, not to apply to that program, but to apply to all applications, at least in that programming language. Uh, and that's uh, how it started. So that's how it was designed. But I was, I wouldn't say I was optimistic about it becoming open source because it takes a lot of resources to open source something. Uh, so I just sort of assumed, let's make it general, let's make it good, and then maybe someday. Uh, but when I announced it uh, within Akamai, uh, I have to say I was uh, delighted because the higher ups, you know, a couple of exec executives were immediately saying, uh, you should put it out there as open source. So uh, short answer is we're just giving back. It's really as simple as that. Who is going to be the target audience for Flow IPC? That's another thing I enjoy about this project is that, uh, in my opinion, it's not really a niche thing. Uh, so as far as I would say at least any developer uh, or architect uh, working on the server side uh, in systems development will find it helpful. Uh, so I would say that's the target audience is system developers and maybe architects. Uh, uh, but I, sh I, I should say in practice, this, uh, this guy in particular is in C++, so it is in the C++ world. Uh, although it would be interesting to expand it to Rust and other things. And if I'm not wrong, this is your first open source project, is that correct? This is personally for me, my first open source project.